all right everybody welcome back to another video we are here today with viking forge uh which despite the fact that it sounds very similar is a new game it's actually the newest of the games on the new game list uh, i had every intention of not recording another video today but i saw this one pop up it looks semi-interesting based on the name so i thought we'd go ahead and uh, play it i have never played this before these are all of my very first spins uh, i know there's some sort of a coin collection uh, thing on this there's also scatters to get into the free spins i'm going to see if they can spin our way into a good bonus here by using our free gold coins you get for signing up over at stake.us and there is a link in the description down below as you see up top the max win is 10,000 x so we're going to go ahead and see how that works out i don't know what determines the multiplier maybe it only adds to the multiplier if it's got the little coins maybe that's what the coins are for the coins make the multipliers that i think is actually the case and that is interesting to say the least we're down to the last couple of spins here that we had set up for beforehand and let's go ahead and lower our bet size down to something semi-reasonable for a game we've never played before uh although the base game is pretty good we're gonna go ahead and uh lower this down to a 3,000 coin bonus by here level. We'll buy our way into a bonus and we'll see exactly how this guy works. That was a neat transition screen there. 10 spins on the screen. That's pretty, pretty normal. And let's see what we can figure out here. Okay, so the queen's connected. There was a multiplier on the queens there. And it looks like the multiplier numbers add up and stick. They sure do. They stick over time. That's pretty neat imagine that number can get pretty high especially if we get lucky enough to get some of these 10 x's that i just saw drop in here uh i don't know tens jacks hammers I mean, i'm just rooting for whatever's got the multiplier on it last spin last spin is not a dead spin that's uh, a nice feature 198 coming through from there 438 coins coming back not the greatest of connections probably not the most wonderful multiplier either Let's go back and see. I think it was like a six or a seven multiplier. We'll see if uh, this one gets any bigger, if it's a little bit lower, just to kind of give us a gauge on where that number can get to. I don't know why some of the multipliers are blue, some are red. I'm not sure the significance to the red ones. There's four scatters on the screen. There's another five spins. So obviously we can re-trigger spins. That's again, good to know. Up to a 2.75 multiplier with eight spins to go here. I didn't look at what top symbol is, but I'm assuming it's the, uh, the guy in the red there. Sure is followed by the hammer. So the Viking and the Viking hammer are top two symbols. No big surprise on something called the Viking Forge. So 361 coming back on the bonus buy there. Let's go ahead and bump up one level here. We'll go to a 4,000 coin bonus buy. See if that makes any difference. I'm sure it won't. I'm also wondering if you only need three in order to re-trigger during the game or if you need all four of them during the bonus to be able to actually re-trigger your spins. Either way, I hope you're all having a wonderful day where we're trying to figure out this new game here. Uh, if you are new or if you are a returning viewer and this is your first time here, if you've been here for 100 videos, either way, thank you very much for joining me. I appreciate each and every one of you that has chosen to spend your time here with me in this very interesting but oddly weird game. 330, so that didn't really do any better. I'm not sure exactly how this one jumps off, so we're going to keep the bet size down a little bit low until we see something big happen on one of these is this another one of those games that looks like it should pay real well but doesn't do anything ever uh because there's plenty of those well that, that's a 20x up on the top now definitely the biggest multiplier we've had thus far doesn't really seem to be make, make much of a difference though if you don't make any connections that's a lot of dead spins one more viking maybe all right so that was a 4150 there it looked like a thousand x multiplier did i see that correctly like on that one win there 
Either way, 4362 is a profit buy. Not much of a profit, but it's a profit. So it, it, it's at least possible. I must be wrong. That, mu that must have said 100x, because there's no way it would have been that low of a win if it had said 1,000. There we go. We got maybe queens can fill out here and give us those multipliers that are sitting up. There we go. If you're going to make the connection, you might, not make, might as well make it on the ones that'll help. There we go. There's a lot of multipliers on those tens there. It does look like the red multiplies. So it takes the the, the current multiplier and multiplies it by its the number that's on the the red symbol. So that is indeed the case. Uh, that was an, an entirely good guess because I had no idea that that's how that worked. So we're currently going to win at 588 with a multiplier of 42.2. Three spins left to go. We really would just, you know, love to add. All right, that's 142.5 because again, that was a red one. There we go, 5,700 with that big multiplier and a pretty good spin. So that is a second bonus in a row with a profit. Okay, so that's how it works. You need to get the big multipliers uh, in order for it to give you the good wins. Uh, otherwise, the tiny multipliers just aren't going to do a thing for you. That's five scatters on the screen. What does that do? That gives us a lot more spins. Okay. Now I want to know what a six scatter does. All right, no red multipliers coming up so far. Uh, they do seem to be semi-rare. Good thing we got the extra spins. This game does also very much seem to be a, uh, a dead spin machine. I was very good at just throwing out spins and not making connections. Very, if I get very interesting mechanics for the game. I'm not really sure how much I like the game itself. It's not visually very appealing. So it's not a, uh, uh, not a game I'm going to want to play just to be able to see it. Uh, like some of the other games that are out there. But it is an interesting mechanic to the game. And we do have a decent multiplier and a good win down there. So that is going to be enough to give us a little bit of a win at 25.95. 33.45 overall. It's about half of what we spent to get into that one. We do another 6,000 coin bonus buy here. See what we can do with that one. Uh, what do you guys think? What do you think of the video down below? Uh, let me know in the comments. I like the transition screen. I like, you know, when the free, sc free spin screen pops up. That's sort of a nice animation. But other than that, it just seems like a set, sort of boring game with a, a little bit of a twist on the mechanic on how it pays but overall i don't know i'm kind of on the fence if you guys want to see this one again let me know in the comments that was absolutely terrible we got nothing on any of those spins i'm gonna go ahead and do one more six thousand coin bonus buy here and then we'll just do an all-in after this based on however much we have left uh, it is a learning experience. We do with do do this once in a while. This is really just for science. We want to see how these things work, and there's no way for us to really know unless we try. It was a real shame to waste a 2x multiplier on a multiplier of one. All right, we got a pretty good win going down the bottom here. We're all over a thousand on the tumbles. Now we just need to get that multiplier up into the mid 30s or 40s. And we can have ourselves a good time here. Last three spins to make it happen. Should be enough at least to give us, uh, you know, money back on the, the game here, which is nice. So, 19-11. Not sure exactly how that happened. It was a 19-11. had like a six multiplier. One of these days, I'll figure out how these games work. In the, in the meantime, let's just go ahead, do it all in at the end here. Keep our fingers crossed. Uh, maybe it's multiplying as it goes. Is that the case? Because if that's the case, it's very disappointing. Uh, it would be really neat if we had the big multiplier up top plus the win on the bottom. Maybe I'll have to look into it a little bit on my own. Uh, just sort of off the recording here just to see if that's exactly what what we're looking at 31x up top though
Last two spins. 180.5 multiplier. Can we can we get something to work with that? Maybe one more at top symbol. No more top symbol there, but 22,250 coins coming back on that very last bonus buy there. So absolutely enough to save the video, bring us right back to where we started for the most part. Interesting game. Let me know what you think uh, while you're down there in the comment section. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next video.